Hey, Monster Mike Schultz here, hanging out on top of the Border X course, getting ready to do my time trial run. Yeah, I hope I can just get a clean run, uh, get my moto knee and versa foot all dialed in and shock set up so I can hit these big kickers. And it's pretty awesome being able to race here as an official event, adapted border cross. There's some awesome talent here. My X Games history goes back a long ways. Uh, my first year out here was actually in 2002, I think it was, um, when I was an able-bodied pro snowcross rider. Never medaled, um, just just never could, could put it all together in one race. And then I had an accident while competing at the professional level on my snowmobile, and I got bucked off the machine and wrecked my knee joint to the point where we had to amputate it. Um, I started to develop my own prosthetic knee and foot system to allow me to get back into action. I'm going for number five in a row for gold medals in the adaptive snow cross. And then this year, the big change is the border cross. Well, basically, my I've got two passions in my life. One's the competitive side, and the other is the, the fabrication and design and building something with my hands and suspension components. and. Is, I think real mechanical about things, so it was kind of natural for me to, to look at my problem and try to figure out a solution. In March of 2009, I started working on drawing up a, a knee component, which I now call the Moto Knee, and it uses a Fox mountain bike shock in it for the dampening. Um, it has compressed air as a spring, and I can really fine tune it to the different activities. This is, this is what I patented on it. Um, so as the knee flexes, it goes through this track system that allows me to get full range of motion out of the knee joint and still have a real natural feedback feel to it. Me as a, a competitor, I, it's all about sponsors and, and that's, that's how I'm able to go racing and training and, and be prepared as I need to be. kept the wax side down the whole time, so I'm pretty excited about it. It's kind of neat that everything went for full circle. I mean, I've got my own company, Biodap, now, and I'm helping some other athletes. And I, I know at some point there's going to be um, another above me amputee, younger, younger kid, up and comer, who's going to be using my equipment and just, uh, you know, just beating me like nothing. So <laughs> hopefully it'll be a couple years yet, but yeah, it, it's really neat.